You may remember this story when a driver slammed into a teenager in a Chick-fil-A drive through so hard that the teen could not walk away. We told you about this back in February. We have the victim, Brittany Knight. There she is on the couch with a broken leg. Our Jason Marks checked in on her right after the accident. Knight used to work at the restaurant all the time, wearing a huge Chick-fil-A cow costume, cheering up families and kids as they rolled through. Well, today, Katrina Boone, the woman who was driving the car, faced the judge on felony hit and run charges. Ava Hurdle was in the courtroom this morning. She joins us now live with the latest. Ava? Don, instead of a trial, Katrina Boone pleaded, to, pleaded guilty, I should say, to a lesser charge, misdemeanor hit and run under a plea agreement. A judge found there was sufficient evidence and accepted the plea. Back on February 4th in the afternoon, police say Boone left the scene of an accident at the Chick-fil-A off North Main Street after her car hit a worker in a cow costume. Brittany Knight was dressed as the mascot and her leg was broken. She had been on the job working in the drive through when she was hit and Boone apparently drove off. Brittany Knight, talk with 10 on your side back then. Accidents do happen, so I... I'm more disappointed at the fact that she didn't stick around to make sure that I was okay. Now the judge is withholding a finding of guilt until Boone's sentencing hearing on October 21st. She faces up to a year in jail. Now back to you.